Easy Riders back again. Right, it's Saturday morning. I haven't seen Chubb for a little while, so we're gonna I'm gonna go over to Chubb's house now. Then we're gonna take a ride over to Bath, I reckon. And uh come with us and come and see what we uh get up to. Yo YouTube Easy Riders back. Another stunning morning in Bristol. Just waiting for the rusty now to turn up. I'm just cycling up and down my uh, the estate to get a little bit warm because it's a little bit chilly. But a beautiful morning. I've got no idea where we're going. Rusty's in charge. So, whilst we're waiting, a few shout outs. And when I say a few shout outs, I got a shitload this morning because it's got a mentor with the subscribers, which is crazy. So I want to say, well, me and Rusty want to say thanks to Paul RG67, Chris Sanders, Steve Williams, Hars Core, Hammer 50 something. He looks like a dude, that bloke. Hammer time. Uh, Mr. Cocus 072002. Rashid Tunnicliffe, Steve Shepherd, Paul Cowley, Bill DeMorris, and Steve Smythe. What a bloody list. I think that's our biggest ever, so thank you all of you. Really appreciate the support. Obviously thumbs up and subscribe. Lovely summer's day. Bright lights. Come on, Creo. Lie in a lie. Good mate. All right. Oh, short socks. Well, it's plenty warm enough, isn't it? Sun's out again. Rusty didn't make it with his shorts yet. No. He did put my shorts on, but I soon took, took them off again. <laughs> took me long trousers on. Rusty's got a new Rusty's got a new funny packed bag on the front. Beautiful. All his gear after his puncture, so he's a bit more prepared now. Here we are then on the Bristol to Bath cycle track. Chubbs had his bike uh, serviced in the week. He's uh, feeling the benefits of that being done. And he's got a range extender fitted. But he won't need that today, because we're only doing about 40 miles. Got that range extender on, Chuff? Yeah. <laughs> uh, B2B now, off to Bath. Bath's a world heritage city for our subbies around the world, in America, or in uh, Japan. They've got the natural spring hot water. Roman baths. Filling up baths, get in there, loads of yeah. minerals. Good for you. If you go in there, you can have a free cup of the Three glasses of hot mineral water. It tastes like shit, yeah. mine, but apparently it's pretty good for you. Yeah. I think you're better off with a can of nat Thatcher's, personally.
for a posh round here. But lovely. Ah, check this out up here. It's called the Royal Crescent in Bath. Look at it, look at what their mice is. Wow. One of the sites of Bath's famous for. Go up here. Oh, cobblestones. Oh. Christ, that is cobbly. Stereotypically English. Somebody's cut the grass, Wimbledon stripes, or Wembley stripes. Another little uh, circus, as they call it, of houses. I don't know if you can see my right hand's a bit, two fingers are taped up and uh, knuckles are swollen. I got, got a bit of an altercation helping a shop assistant apprehend a shoplifter. Ironically, on the day of my birthday last week. Thanks for the birthday wishes, by the way. Yeah. I grab him. And when I did point him, my middle finger or went a bit too far to the right. So, uh, yeah, a bit sore, changing gears and all that, but one of them things. Can't see a bloke pushing a woman around, especially when she was like 60. Anyway, got the goods back and he, uh, Liked it. Heading towards Bathampton now. Chup's taken me to a hill called Prospect Place. Apparently it's 20 to 30 degrees. It's called the Mega Hill. We're gonna see if we can conquer it. There's the banner down up there on the left. GCN famous hill. I've done a couple of videos on that. So what we're going to look to do is just up here somewhere is another road called, oh I'm not even sure it's a road, I think it's like a track called Prospect Place, which apparently is really, really steep. Uh, somebody at work told me about it. So we're going to go and have a look. Not sure about this, if I'm honest. <laughs> uh, Got my skinny wheels on. It's probably better off with the gravel tiles, but let's have a look. Not the best on hills, great lump that I am, but we'll see. Oh, taking a left. Tidy. The crying pub. Seven, he's nice. Just better that's got an old Ford engine in that, probably a cross flow. Somewhere turning up there. <laughs> See, it's just here. Goes up there, I think. <laughs> Prospect Place, C 
see the sign, 25% it says out there. Chubb's all nervous. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Free stone every year. <laughs> oh, dear. He said, let's have a look at it. I reckon we'll, I reckon I'll lick that, no probs, on the Creo 2. Flipping owls bells. That is proper steep. That does look steep. Still a bit of zigzagging. Let's get the gears down. Ah, piss of piss. Let's do it. We're on 13, 14. I ain't clipping in just in case I gotta clip out quickly. Same in. Ah, breeze in it. Nice. Oh, first bit done. Ah, steep, mate. You ain't seen it there. Do it. Whoa. Yeah, that's nice, isn't it? Oh, that's the bend then. My mate was on about. Apparently, in the wet conditions, you come up here on your bike. Your back wheel just slips around that bend. Oh, blown out me. Beep. Trub's putting one of his famous Easy Rider sticker on this signpost in a minute, if you can get the backing off. We're on Prospect Place Hill, right on the bend. If you're out here any time, you want a challenge, check out the sticker. I'm going to do it. I'm going to have a go. I'm going to do it. It's got to be done. All right, see you in a bit. See how we get on. Woohoo! It's got to keep going. Let's have a go. Twenty two degrees, twenty three degrees. Just take your time. Fit me the Wahoo saying climb. Twenty five degrees. Oh, let me know. You can hear the motor working. Do it, no problem. Here he comes. I knew you'd want to do it if I'm doing it. Oh, mate. 
It's a gooder. Looking at? No. No. <sighs> Christ, he's being sick. I know. <laughs> yeah. oh. I got the added bonus. I got a little bit more torque in my motor than the old Creo one. It definitely made easy, uh, made that easy, that little hill. That was a killer. Oh, I can't even talk. Coming down the old Prospect Hill. It's flipping dodgy, just coming down it. Steep as you like. Giving the brakes a good sort out though. I think I'm definitely going to change my pads to the Swift Stop ones. A couple of people have commented about it. It's going to get done. Where is he? Where's the Chubbers too? Where is he? Where the bloody hell is he? Where's Chubb? I've bloody lost him. Where's he gone? Oh, that has made me feel well funny. Oh dear. I thought I'd do that again. Chubb! Where are you? There he is, I think. There he is, got to be him. Richard! Girl lost you! Sorry, mate. That's alright. Oh, that's only five minutes. Oh, there. Sad. <laughs> no, move. Alright, we're just approaching Bathampton little toll bridge can't believe someone was left this in their whip in a wheel and uh it's still getting the old toll on the old bridge what's that a pound he's turning around he ain't got a pound see you later he said down here is a lovely pub uh, wicked weir Sweet. Lovely. Apparently it pays for the maintenance of the bridge, but I think it's just a lovely little uh, extra side hustle, extra cash. This is the Bathampton Mill pub. Gonna get in there and have a bar of chocolate. Oh. Oh, dear. So is that all now, though? Yeah. Two colours now. So when it's fully charged, it's only halfway up the blue. So all those greens are go, and then you got all the blue. All oh, right. Not too long. Del it, del it. Boom. I reckon that eel took ten percent out of my battery. Honestly, this is a little bit better than last time.
Oh. Guess what I've done? What? Left me glasses on the table. Oh, you am. I told you to pick them up. Okay. <laughs> I'm just thinking that. Isn't it so? I was thinking really bright on my eyes. I'll, go on, I'll go slow this way. He's got his glasses back. Oh, After having a funny five minutes. Hyperventilating. <laughs> the goat's okay on the hills. Yeah, the goat is okay. It's all the very sterile pieces they've got today. Half of the pit here. Goat found that prospect place easy. Yeah, it's a pit. <laughs> <laughs> Does anyone know mate? It's deeper, I don't know what's the challenge, I want to bring it on. You've got, go you got to go at that other one, yeah? Gosh, he's got some new shoes on as well. What are they, mate? Specialised? Specialised. Summer Galaxy Storm. You better get some shares in Specialised, don't you? The amount of flipping <laughs> gear you're buying off them. Waiting for Rusty to have a pee. Absolutely knackered I am. That flipping prospect place done me right in. 25%. Oh, my legs are like jelly. That's with full power on as well. Yeah, I shan't be doing that again. 53 year old, 15 stone lump like me. That can't be good for you. But I've done it. Sticker it at the flying post at the bottom. If you're passing. Yeah, that is one hell of a climb. Fair play to anybody who does that without batteries. Outrage. Rusty's just noticed on a lamppost at Bitten Railway that I previously stuck a sticker and it's gone. They're so sort of after the chat. Some nicked, so son it. of a gun has nicked our sticker. That is outrageous. Call the police. Yeah. So they pulled it off very carefully so they could stick it on their bedroom door. Outrage. It's the old station at Mangotsfield. All the old platforms.
been in eco mode now for the last 10 miles just saving some of the battery happy days here we are back home hope you enjoyed the video if you did please like and subscribe don't forget e-bike miles are better than no miles later just drop chub back at his house I got about four or five miles an hour to get back to my all good back now from our uh, prospect place ride I thought it was easy to be fair but there we go if anyone's got any better reels than that comment in the comments and all that about it and I'm up for a mega challenge we're on three nine one subscribers now let's get to 400 by next week so if you like the videos like and subscribe tell your mates thanks for all the new suburbs over and out see you soon